MP Chris Davis is tonight considering his future in politics after being sacked as Assistant Health Minister overnight. The member for Stafford was axed to the back bench for publicly criticising government policy. The government has strict rules about what its employees can and can't say. Social media man makes it plain. Don't post comments that are critical of your department or its policies or that are unjustified attacks on your employer. That applies to MPs too. He's a terrific man. He's got a lot to offer. It's just that um, there are certain rules and we all have to play by the rules. Chris Davis was shown the door late yesterday after siding with doctors in the hospital dispute and criticising changes to the CMC. On occasions, uh, the Cabinet makes decisions on matters which I don't agree with, but you will never know because that's the way the system works. The Premier says he's done him a favour. See, Dr Davis, as a backbencher in the LNP, actually is liberated. I would have wished to have been liberated without this change. Dr Davis is considering his next move. His demotion has cost him about $80,000, but a split from the LNP seems unlikely. Labor says the Premier overreacted. He's prepared to stand by the likes of Scott Driscoll and Bruce Flegg and Ros Bates, yet he sacks someone who has an alternative view to himself. The Premier wants to keep Dr Davis on his team. The question is whether Dr Davis wants to play on and he's considering what happens if he quits politics altogether. Were I to vacate the seat, the seat would be vacated in all likelihood till the next general election. That's something he won't do, but stay tuned. I will be making a more formal and complete statement uh, on Friday. Shane Doherty, Nine News.